Oh, it's snowing. We have, uh, I don't know, one meter new snow. Ah. Yeah, you will see it soon on the rooftops. Gell? Yeah, now we go to our favorite hotel here. Altus. Oh, crazy. Look over there. We were waiting the whole winter long. <laughs> yeah, to have winter wonderland. And now in April. <laughs> yeah, we are finally here. Yeah, the terrace is closed today. <laughs> yeah. Too much snow. Oh. Mm, nice to be back. It smells already so good after fresh wood. Yeah. And we've ordered a blue sky and it will come soon. Yeah. These are special rooms. They are called Holz 100. Yeah, there's no food yet here. Holz 100 rooms. And uh, um, most of the wood here uh, comes from the nearby forest. Yeah, and when you are here, you feel like a marmot. <laughs> yeah. And this house is a lot of love. And when I was younger, yeah, I used to call with this thing. Just take this one and then you dial. Huh? So like this. And then hello. <laughs> All the rooms have a main tree, a main wood, and this one is Eige. Eige. Yeah, it's this one. So we just checked in, and now I had big friends already at home. <laughs> yeah, we do the panorama hike from uh, Moosvlue to Riedefurka, and then back again. Ah, oh, mega schön. Yeah, one of the most beautiful winter hikes you could do. Huh? Look the amount of snow on the rooftops. Huh? But to reach Rieder Alp, from Betna Alp, we need to hike another panorama hike. <laughs> yeah, there are many here. And uh, this will take about 20 minutes. And then we are at the gondola up to Moosflue. No clouds. You can see the Matterhorn somewhere over there. Yeah, if we are lucky enough, we will see you it uh, in the morning. Rasta is of course off on the leash. Yeah, until we are yeah, in the big white snow. Ooh, I like it. Up here it is winter. And it is snowing right now. And down in the valley, spring arrived. It is not unusual that it is snowing in April here because we are on 2000 meters above sea level. Yeah, so it could snow even in summer. <laughs> Rasta is a huge fan of a gondola, <laughs> so he can't wait to go on the gondola. Huh, Rasta, which go gondola for? Yeah, but we need to wait, gal, until the big cloud is over, gal. Yay, Citroen, we are in. Yeah, it looks very cloudy now, but yeah, I'm, I'm risky and uh, I make a promise now that we will see amazing moods and blue sky and foggy clouds moving around us. Yeah, it's snowing, Rasta. And I also make a promise for you. We will see no people <laughs> because the weather is so bad. Gal? But the people don't know that the weather will change. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we are here. <laughs> so we see nothing. But hey, wait, Gal. Yeah, it comes good. The gondolas are still running behind me. But at four o'clock, they stop. Yeah, and then every skier is down. 
And we are alone here. Yeah, Rasta, then it's your time. Yeah, we have to share this part with the skiers. Um, but soon they separate. And then there is a one hiking path and then ski path. Hmm. Oh, Rasta. It's deep snow. <coughs> yeah. And if you want to follow Rasta's path, <laughs> just follow the yellow sign spot. A sign from heaven. Yeah, probably um, some of you wouldn't dare to walk this winter hike. But um, yeah, there is no risk because there is no um, steep mountain around us. So no danger of avalanche. And uh, in one hour you are at Rieder Alp. Uh, there are sign spots so you can't get lost. So everything is fine. And I have Rasta, yeah, my guardian. <laughs> uh, it's getting better now. Huh? I think that was the last snow cloud for today. And as I told you, if you get lost, yeah, follow Rasta sign spots. And what you can see over there, yeah, it's white and white, but this is the Alec Glacier. You can't see the hiking path here because the wind was blowing all the snow away. Yeah, but we have the pink sign spots so we can't get lost. Everything is fine. Sometimes you just have to be patient. Yeah, it's not my biggest skill, <laughs> but uh, nature teached me, yeah, to be patient. Well, Rasta, Ali, Ali, are you tired or what? Huh?
I tell you now something. Now you see the Villa Castle? Yeah, from this point of view. Then I zoom, double, and it is like this. And if you zoom like five times, it is like this. And now, if the clouds would disappear, you would see the Matterhorn just behind the Villa Castle. Yeah, and I have a proof. I made pictures with my tele lens. Yeah, and it looks like this. And people were saying, this is fake. It's not possible to do this. But it is, yeah, with a tele lens. Yeah, it's interesting, huh? Optik. Four hours hiking, we are finally back at our wonderful hotel, Waldhuis in the Petma Alp. And now it's time for dinner. Razda is totally done. <laughs> yeah, love quiet, sleep well. We enjoyed a wonderful dinner and during this time my camera recorded what was happening outside. The morning promised fog at first, but then it was supposed to get nicer. But a good day starts with a healthy breakfast. Once we filled our bellies, we'll show you around the village of Betper Alp. Rasta was still tired from our long winter walk yesterday and slept in the hotel room during this time. Oh, it was so foggy during the night. Yeah, but now it's perfect. It is the day after the Easter weekend. Yeah, so almost everyone went back home again. Yeah. And uh, I think the, the cattle cars are going to last day drive until the end of week. Yeah. And then they open again in summer. And now it's time to fly.
This time up here is a kind of a holiday for me, even though I'm always working to bring you this experience. This winter visit was the perfect end for us. Mother Nature has shown us the most beautiful sights of the cold season once again. And now we are ready for spring. <laughs> 